Hello, you're watching another SEO Content Machine Next tutorial video. Today it's going to be a quick one. We are going to cover the usage of the article rewriter that you can find in the article creator task. So I've opened a example task already and now we have to rewrite the tab. By default, all the content that SEO Content Machine finds is downloaded online from existing articles. Now when you generate a new article, your article will be a mismatch of a bunch of different paragraphs from articles from different sites uh, placed together to form one article. In a matter of speaking, this content, although it's not unique because it already exists, your article as a whole is unique. However, we want to make sure that the content also inside our article is as unique as it can be to give it the best chance of getting uh, indexed and hopefully appear in the Google search results. So here's the article rewriter screen. And by default, when you create a task, the soft spinner is selected for you. This is a free spinner that comes loaded with SEO Content Machine. You don't have to pay for this. It's given to you for free. Just one thing, the soft spinner is English only. Moving down the list, we have a bunch of other supported spinners. Some of these are English, some of these are in Spanish. Uh, then we also have spinners for other languages such as French. One recommendation, if you want to spin languages that are not supported by any of the spinners on the list, I recommend you look at XSpinner as it has the ability to download and spin multiple different languages that most other programs cannot. So once you've selected your spinner service, the next setting I want to quickly cover is the Save Articles with Spin Text. For those new to generating content this way, you may notice that when you open your generated article, it has a bunch of funny looking symbols in them. So these symbols are the two curly brackets and a pipe symbol. This is a special format and the text is being saved in spin text code. If you have a program or a link building program that can read spin text code, you can keep the content with all those symbols intact and it means that anytime that article is used, a new rewritten version is taken. However, sometimes you want to take the content and publish it directly online, maybe to your WordPress blog. In that case, WordPress editor does not understand spin text and is unable to use it. In situations like that, where you just need the article without any spin text symbols, please click on and select the Don't Allow Spin Text selection on the right here. By clicking on this, you ensure your articles come out as just plain text without any symbols in them. Finally, we have the protect words box. This is important as you may not want the spinner to rewrite your primary keyword or related keywords that may be in the content. In that case, I suggest you put at least your primary keyword within the protect words box here. Finally, I want to quickly let you know that for all the spinner services here that are listed that are not free, such as Chimp Rewriter, it's very easy just for you to click this link here that says click here to fill out your API logins. It will open up this panel and from here you're able to click on any spinner and it'll drop down and it'll allow you to fill out your API details.